Let me know when you want to see it. We'll get you on board. I'm on the Viking 70. I'm gonna, it's got a great cockpit. Going inside. You can see why I like this boat. Lots of room. Beautiful interior. The ceilings are all loose. They all, all have to be done. But other than that, I don't really see anything. The wood looks good. Upholstery looks good. Galley looks perfect. It's got an up galley, full size stainless refrigerator, freezer. Floors look good. That's your galley. Stairs to the bridge inside. It's your dining table next to your galley. Looking at the helm, we've got a door next to your helm, which is really nice. You can get out and take a look. Got upgraded Ma Garmin electronics, Furuno, bow and stern thruster. That should make it easy for you to drive the boat. Good visibility right over the helm. So we're going to go downstairs. And it's got a big stairway, big open space, easy to come up and down. And to your starboard, you've got your Queen VIP. Very nicely done. Needs nothing. All the wood's good. You've got the shared bathroom. You go forward. This is your VIP stateroom. Again, it really needs nothing. It's got its own bathroom and shower. Everything looks great. Skylight, hanging closets, everything looks good. Got a little dresser here. Going back is the master, the owners. Again, you've got lots of space here. Yes, yeah, this is a four cabin boat. You've got Pullman upper and lower. Your family and your kids are going to love this. Going downstairs. Very, very nice master cabin. Nice windows. It's a big master cabin. There's an office set up. Big screen TV. And we'll go back into the bathroom area here. Looks like big hanging lockers here. And they're locked right now. I don't want to open them. And you've got your bathroom with your shower. It's a big shower. That's kind of it from here. Let's go upstairs. Come back. Let's go take a look at the bridge. Super easy stairs, beautifully done. Teak is perfect on this boat. We're up on the bridge. It's got a pop-up helm. Electronic controls, balance turn thruster, stereo, VHF. You know, it's got a 5212. Not the most modern, but it'll do. It's got an older Furuno Navnet. You may want to swap that out. Good visibility forward. All the upholstery looks fine. I don't see any issues at all. Teak, no issues. Rails, no issues. In the back, you can put a tender back here. And there's pads, sun pad storage. Big davit. Got your sat TV antennas. Go back and look down on the cockpit now. So you can see the swim step is below us. And it's very clean. I mean, there's no real issues on this boat. We're going into the engine room now. Going down the stairs. Going to hang on a little steep. First, we've got crew quarters. Let's see what we got here. Got 
a two crew. There's a big bathroom in here. It's a nice crew bathroom, crew shower, comfortable. This is an equipment room here. You've got your Glendenning, your generator, filters, water maker. We get in the engine room. We are in the engine room. Doesn't look too bad. Suppose that they have all the hours from the local mechanics who maintain the boat. They'll get those hours for you. The big man engines. Here's the cruise air chillers. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Got seven refrigeration units. So that's about it. I'm in the engine room. The Viking 70. Viking Princess 70. Let's get you on board next week. Talk to you later. Bye. Let me know when you want to see it, we'll get you on board.